Welcome to the project demonstration of smart trolley using RFID technology with auto billing and theft detection along with payment mode by using the Bluetooth. So here uh, we have the two sections. So this is the cart section which will come along with the trolley and this was uh, will present at the billing section. So the billing details will be sent to the mobile phone or oh sorry uh, to the laptop through this USB to TTL converter and the communication between the two modules is we are using Zigbee RF communication so the data will be sent from this trolley section to the building through the Zigbee and the same details will be displayed on this laptop there is a one way for the building and another way is to uh, do the payment so from this HC05 Bluetooth module we are going to do the payment and once the payment would have accepted so it will be cleared and the next it will go on we are reading with the next uh, customers products and the third point is to detect the theft detection so for the purpose we are going to use the RFID reader one more at the building section also so for example consider so the two in these two products so we are showing the products one and two and three and four so if product one and three are shown and product four was not shown here means it was not built so then if the product was detected at the billing section end then automatically buzzer will get switched on and alert message will be displayed on the LCD screen as well as on the PC screen also. So these are the three main features. So to execution of these steps we are making use of PIC 16F73 microcontroller at both end. So coming to the trolley section we have interfaced the RFID reader at A0 pin of microcontroller and pin number B2 to B7 for the LCD, Bluetooth at C6, C7 and RF at B0, B1. And coming to the billing section, so we have interfaced the USB to TTL converter at B0, B1 and the RF module at C6, C7 and LCD at pin number B2 to B7 and RFID at A0 and the next buzzer is connected to C4 pin at the billing section. So let us see the demonstration. Before on the gates, we need to uh, install one application in your mobile phone and laptop also. So that is uh, SC05 Bluetooth application which is available in the Play Store. This is the icon of that application. So install that application first. And the next, go to the uh, laptop. So this is the billing section, uh, PC output. So for this application, we need to install PL2303 app. So we provide you that. So this is the application we need to install. This is PL2303. This one we need to install and the next is the iPad terminal. So after installation at the end of installation the system will prompt us to insert the PL2303. Then we need to insert this at USB slots. So if you insert at a USB one then it will provide us a COM number. So welcome message on the LCD screen it is monitoring. So to get the communication number of this uh, USB TTL module, right click on the this PC, go to manage and in that uh, go to device manager. So there we will get the ports here, right. So it will show the COM4. Instead of showing the COM4, it will ask us to uh, contact your product uh, developer, then right click on that and update driver and browse computer for drivers let me pick up from the list so there we can see the 2008 version so click on that if it is shows 2008 version then click on that then go on next 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 it will be installed and then we get the com number so note on the com number as we are getting com number is com4 now go to hyper terminal folder and in that click on this hello icon application there type any name whatever you want you can enter and the COM number which we got from that application. So enter, select the COM4 and next uh, restore defaults. I am repeating the settings. Enter any name you want. Select the COM number properly which we got from the device manager and next restore defaults. Right. Now the system is open now. So if we reset the system, this is a restart, a restart switch. If we reset that, so you will get the welcome message. Now the system was ready. And coming to the mobile phone. So in the mobile phone, <coughs> so on the card section now, 
so welcome message so when you are executing the project in a mobile phone first time then looking for a new device so hc05 it will ask for the password then in the only first time setup next time onwards automatically it will coming into your pair devices now go to the application that is application so pair to hc05 now the device will be connected over here right successfully is connected after pairing from that the bluetooth module will blinks slowly now let me show you the products so when we show the tag so product 1 shown and the bill was and same sent to the laptop section also so we can observe now product 2 if i show the same tag again then automatically the money will be reduced for the respective products right so i don't want the product now so you can observe that so when i'm showing this tag so it will show the lcd the product took out and the remaining balance so when i send p after my payment so my application will send p character so bill cleared so here also transaction is under process so right now it's totally cleared now so as we discussed this was not shown at the product end okay same see again product 1 and if it was detected over here then automatically alert 1 product not included so like this in this manner we are going to identify the theft detection also and billing and auto billing section